you want to create a very powerful playback page and you want to use it in your busking file, for example, Graname 3 version 2.2 gives you more flexibility to do that. What you know already since a couple of versions is that you can define a pool action. So for example, for your sequence pool, where you have all your sequences ready, when you go to the pool settings, you can define a pool action, like for example, a go plus or a flash action. So for the flash action, you will see that all the objects now, if you press them, they will execute a flash on your sequence. Of course, a nice tool to use it, especially for busking. But you can also set the pool actions to none or the default select. What you can do now is also to define a specific object action. So no matter if you have a pool action or not, you can go into a specific object to define the object action individually. So go to the edit settings of your object activate the settings here and have a look at the object action which you can find in the playback section. Here you can follow the pool default so then the object does what the pool action tells it to do but you can also define a specific action for this specific object. So for example this should be a flash. We close this and in the pool settings we just have to define that we want to use the object action. So we could say no, then only the pool action would dictate what the object do. But we can also use the individual object action if we enable it here. And then the pool action could be, for example, a go plus. But we remember that for our sequence number three, so for song one, we defined a flash here. So we have a go over here and a flash over there.